Hello, just a quick video today on understanding family law superannuation valuations. My name is Arnold Shields of Forensic Accountants Dolman Bateman and we have been specialising in superannuation valuation for family law since 2001 when the legislation came into effect. We get a number of questions in relation to the Form 6 superannuation form and we would like to cover some of those questions today. What is the value of an accumulation interest? An accumulation interest comprises contributions either by the employee or the employer and earnings on those contributions. The vast majority of people have accumulation interests. Under Regulation 31 of the Family Law Superannuation Regulations 2001, the valuation of a accumulation interest is quote the gross value at the relevant date of the interest in the value of the interest stated in the statement unquote in other in other words the value of an accumulation interest is the members balance in the fund The trustee will state the family law value of the accumulation interest at item 2 of part A of the superannuation information form. In this case, the trustee has stated that the value of the fund as at 15 July 2009 is $68,000. The family law value is therefore $68,000 and there is no need to get a valuation, a further valuation, of the member's interest. The valuation of defined benefit superannuation interest is considerably more problematic and eight schedules of the regulations and five volumes of the scheme specific methods are devoted to the valuation of defined benefit interests. Luckily the trustees of most defined benefit superannuation schemes now provide a valuation in accordance with the Family Law Superannuation Regulations 2001 so that you do not have to go to the additional expense of getting a forensic accountant to value the interest based on the information that the trustees provide. Presently only the Commonwealth superannuation schemes like the DFRDB, Military Super, CSS and PSS are requiring an additional valuation by someone like myself. So how do we tell if the trustee has valued a defined benefit interest? If the trustee has completed Part C, Item 1 of the, um, of the form, with the statement that has been valued in accordance with the Family Law Superannuation Regulations 2001 as at the relevant date, then the interest has been valued by the superannuation trustees. In this case, the answer is 260000 So the Family Law value of the defined benefit interest is 260000 Thank you for watching this short video and I hope that this helped your understanding of the Family Law Superannuation Form. Please feel free to comment on our website if you liked or didn't like this video and I would welcome any suggestions for any other topics. My name is Arnold Shields of Forensic Accountants Dolman Bateman and thank you.